My name is Dr. Bhavni Lakani and I'm doing the Dental Law and Ethics Masters at the University of Bedfordshire. So I completed my undergraduate in dentistry uh, what seems like many years ago now and I've been working in practice and also in secondary um, services as well since then for a few years and I thought it was, just, it was time to do something different um, after having experienced a few complaints from patients or having heard from colleagues about how common complaints are from patients. I thought it's really important to have a good understanding of how we should handle them and what the legislation around this is. And that's why I decided to do this course at the University of Bedfordshire. It's quite a, an uncommon thing to do. So, so very few universities offer it and um, the University of Bedfordshire is known for this course. Um, a lot of dentists recommend it as well. A lot of my colleagues and peers had also recommended doing this. Um, it made them more confident as clinicians, but also in themselves and handling complaints. And that's why I decided to do it. So I've just completed the first year of this um, degree, so it's three years. and. I didn't really know what to expect. So when I applied for it, there was no COVID. And then when we started, things changed quite rapidly. Um, from the teaching, I thought that they adapted really well. So they, they created so many online and virtual resources for us, and they completely transformed the course um, to ensure that we had the support while learning from a distance. Uh, so the teaching courses, the lectures, and the one-on-one -on -one mentoring sessions that we were also offered were incredible. Um, they really assisted us in the assignments and, and the journey as a student. So through the assignments, we've learned different skills. So the first is academic writing. As a dentist, you usually write your notes and you write the prescription, whereas this is very different. And the university has supported us with um, you know, teaching sessions about how to write academically uh, and uh, complete our assignments. One of our assignments was a podcast, so we developed speaking skills. You know, we speak to patients all the time, but talking academically about papers and principles is very different. And I found that to articulate myself well, I had to put in a lot of work, but it's a, a great skill to learn. Mm -hmm. 